California is looking for ways to fight the drought. The South Bay has received a proposal for a desalination plant, but hit a roadblock. Valley View News reporter Jorina Silva has more on the story. Hermosa Beach has joined the growing opposition for a new seawater desalination plant. The West Basin District has been looking at the NRG power plant right behind me to house the desalination plant if the proposal gets approved. It's on the border of Manhattan Beach and El Segundo. The Hermosa Beach City Council voted unanimously to send the district a preliminary letter of opposition. The district has already received a letter from neighboring city Manhattan Beach because it would cost $300 million. Critics say it also has harmful effects on the environment and marine life. Some residents think the plant would be beneficial. You know, given the current drought conditions and so forth, I really believe that we need this freshwater access. Um, as long as it doesn't negatively impact the ocean's ecosystem or prevent anyone from accessing the beach, I think it's a, a, a great project. The plant would turn 20 to 60 million gallons of seawater into drinking water every day. In Manhattan Beach, Jarena Silva, Valley View News.